It's total for the Peter Channel Morning News on this Friday morning, January 27th, 2017. Get out! Get out! Get out! Ah, good morning to you all. This lovely Friday morning, January 27th, 2017. Here, the time is. 7.50 in the morning time, it's 10 minutes, 8 minutes, 300 degrees, they're not in today's aisle, be 43 here now, the Peter Cello, more to do is at 7.50. Top story is, President Trump definitely wants to build a wall, while the United States border, we're back to go. President Donald Trump, and President, President Vladimir Putin, have a telephone conversation this week, and according to both to us, said, your administration official and the Kremlin. Meanwhile, President Trump's obsession, they decides to not get a crowd, so even run deeper with any letters first on, with the tweets, then many public comments about the numbers. Donald Trump speaks to Angela Merkel about Russia on the same day he talks about it for the first time. Republican presidential deputy Donald Trump as media goes berserk of a bitted bluster. Tens of thousands of demonstrators are expected to Washington Friday for an anti Washington march to achieve them as a triumph uh, for under Donald Trump. Despite President Trump's ambitious projection of the crowds as large as 600,000. President Trump and British Prime Minister Theresa May will take their first step toward an establishment of strong economic and strategic ties during a Friday meeting at the White House. President Trump will keep his plan to remove the U.S. Embassy in Israel to Jewish former New York City Mayor Wubach Jenner said, but despite passing a warning to such a semblance spark violence and sometimes to the prospect of renew. Lunar New Year, which campus says Chinese New Year's Spring Festival begins on June 27 and ends on February 2nd. While Chinese New Year is part of Lunar New Year, Lunar New Year is not necessary. Chinese New Year is more than a blanket. At the age of 13, Susan Powell, now retired grandmother living in North London, was taken to a home in a rural Hungary, loaded a cattle truck and was put by a rare fat juvenile combat bowler. When the Oregon Street Experience Festival of Us Playwright, Lisa Luminous should be interested in the run and play about. Rolf is the way she was understandably skeptical. The shooter in the Fort Lauderdale Airport could face death and be convicted of the shooter at Fort Lauderdale Hallwood International Airport. Washington and President Barack Obama and the Justice Department spent the better part of the decade battling a strict foot ID law in Texas with several federal judges found to be discriminatory. A Florida man accused of killing his pregnant ex wife and failing shooting a police officer during a man that left another cop dead is coming enough to wave his right to the law at Judge Will on Thursday. France banned unlimited reveals of soft drinks at restaurants by the law put in an effect by the campaign to reduce obesity. A man was charged with eight crimes and attacking a Muslim worker at JFK Airport while saying President Donald Trump will get rid of all you. Vice President Mike Pence will speak at the March of the Life and the Annual Anti Abortion Protest for the National Ball in Washington, D.C. A man suffered a life threatening injury after the SUV crashed into the utility pole near Upper Pole Hospital in South Africa on Thursday night. Google parent company, Alphabet Incorporated, reported a 20% surge in the fourth quarter revenue to 26.1 billion dollars, while the growth exceeded analyst expectations of the company's 8.3% increase in the part fulfilled. Short of the expectation, the stock fell 2.3%. To achieve it, the sell part of the chip business puts overseas nuclear ops under review. The clock media company has reported with some worldwide countries that what to expect to be the biggest merger in Atlanta in years. At Financial Service Corporate, the world's largest financial technology company, set on Thursday night with a car, U.S. money transfer company. Money Graham and International for about $80 million dollar deal that expected to shake up. Alright, take a look at the stocks now. Up 32.4 points at 2109, one SP5, that 1.6 at 2296.68, and that's at 1.16 at 5655.18. Then the 79th generation of the bull in the American Thomas Sanders to show me how the fate of Tuesday's clock was printed with an optimism. Image of diamond handles, compressed bulk, hydrogen, and high pressure set will converge to a similar hydrogen to show that to be It excavated the medieval side of the St. Mary Bagan and Hospital Cemetery in Chapel with Chester Angle researchers who are looking at genotypes of strain of leprosy. Leaders of several of the nation's top sciences organizations have been shunned by the Trump administration and alarmed by signs that the administration of Muslim government researchers and rejected the scientific evidence in the form so much. Al Gore revives climate summit that the CDC abruptly canceled. The Trump administration team split about ads that encourage people to sign up health insurance under former President Barack Obama and his health care law. Chicago Americans and surgeons struggles in parts of the country at after cancer and rates, even as the cancer death rate rates continues to fall. Exhausted new analysts found. 
Peter Challenge News Times, now 7.54. And take a look at New England stories, but it's in the early morning part at 11 a.m. and 7 p.m. Masters. There was heavy fire, wet fire, an unknown size type of structure. Grizzly of Sumner, DFS, and we have Boston, Bob Meaning, took care of the DWH citywide. And now look at you, sports time here. The Boston Bruins defeat the Pittsburgh Penguins 43 at the Garden last night. Boston Celtics have a game against 11 a.m. after game time, 7.30 p.m. And tonight, the North Lancers boys basketball team will have a game against Dover Sherbert. Game time is 6.30 p.m. The clock is almost 30 to kind of end the round of summer. Again, they never finish out. So when the Bulls finally part ways in the Miracle Park Guard, the rest of the NBA should take the runners to do a long and probable NBA player. Georgia Gaskets, Jermaine sales at seven matches before a Super Bowl while Bill Belichick outlines. Everything Falcons quarterback Matt Brand as well and it's Kid Penny being running out of plays. Peter Chill News Times. Now, 7.56 on it's Friday morning here, and it's time out for a traveling and transit park. Baby! Let's start you off in the MBT, where on the subway system is still on S5 space to minor laser disabled bus. So on S4 space to minor laser disabled bus. Can be the rail. It's looking good it on the ferries. They are looking good. Wait, hey, take a look at Hours and Bowie's. Starting off down in Connecticut, where it's 95, stop by time, but a fair fit on the Greenwich, Merritt Parkway, West by time, stop by the Gulf between Bridgeport and Dorbach, 95 to Dorp by time, back to West Haven down New Haven, 84 East by time, about Newtown, 84 East by time, hit the brakes, getting from Newington down to Nantown, North Connecticut, 8, 91 and stop by time, back to 291, 84, 91 and North by time, back to 84 and North Connecticut, 291, West by time, back to 91 and North Connecticut, 91 and North by time, back to 57, 291 in Springfield. Central Massachusetts, 199, North Bandside, Battle Run, West Boston, 290, East Bandside, Battle Run, 146, Route 9. Mass Packer Change with 290, 295, Autumn, it's a little slow down in Rhode Island, 146, on the South Bandside, it's backed up at Buffalo Run, Route 95, Downtown Providence, 95, on the South Bandside, Battle Run, Protected to Downtown Providence, 95, on the North Bandside, Battle Run, Work Island, Downtown Providence, 195, West Bandside, Battle Run, Seacon, down to Downtown Providence, 99, North Bandside, Battle Run, 126, and one second, 95, on the North Bandside, Battle Run, 120, and Captain, 120, on North Bands have a split all the way up to 24 in Kent. Route 3 on the North Bands have a bad Rank 3 split around Union Street. Route 6 to the East Bands have a back to back to Route 134 South Dennis to do some road work. Out in Boston vicinity, Bass Park East Bands have a back to around Western Island, Newton Quarter, South East Bands have a back to around the British Park Parkway all the way down to South Boston. South East Bands have a back to around the back to around South Boston and his breaks get around the brakes split. 93 is South Bastard. It's back to the South Station Tunnel, downtown Boston. Mass Power, West Bastard. Back to the Florida Border, and on the South Boston. Mass Power, East Bastard. Back to the Austin Brighton Tolls. 93 is South Bastard. It is back to the Bastard. It's back to Bridge Boston. 93 North Bastard. Start of the Route 128 in Brennan. 120 is South Bastard. Backed up by Brennan all the way at Route 93. Route 120 is South Bastard. Back to Route 2 in Lexington. 120 is North Bastard. It's backed up by Great Point Avenue. Need them on the way after. Route 20 Waltham. Route 3 is South Bastard Battle 45. Low all the way out. Down to Burwick and Hippie Square. 128. In Route 45, South Bastard Battle Run. Long stretch. 93 South Bastard Battle Run. Back the Dirt Rapture. And Spotted Turbox South Bastard Battle Run. 202 out in Durham Rapture. And then here's 89. South Bastard Back to the Canadian border in upstate Vermont. 87 of South Bastard Slow up to upstate New York. After the Canadian border, 91 of the North Bandside, back to London, Vermont, and Ottawa is 50 and 55. North Bandside, slow up to Canadian after the U.S. border in southern Quebec. Peter Chell, do sign the approach at 8 o'clock on this Friday morning. And it's time now for a weather report where we've been seeing some spotty precipitation stretching the line from Waltham, stretching it all the way down to Concord and stretching it around Fitchburg and a little line of precipitation west to western, stretching around Springfield as we take a look at. A much closer look at it, and that is in the form of some snow showers here. And check out that radar, and it did shows a lot of snow showers stretching from Maine all the way down around New York State and going a bunch of Pennsylvania and Northern Jersey and stretch around the Great Lakes region and up into Michigan and the Neville Island snow showers from West Virginia stretching down the Seven Island and the Indiana down in Kentucky here. All right, seven-day forecast goes like this.
A slight chance of snow shots before 9 a.m. Then a slight chance of rain shots. Then most of the sky is about 43 degrees. West about 9 to 50 miles of gunsight. 30 miles of anticipation, 20%. Then a slight chance of rain shots before 8 p.m. Then a slight chance of snow shots between 8 p.m. and 1 a.m. Most of the sky is about 29 degrees. West about 9 to 5 miles of gunsight. 30 to 5 miles of anticipation is 20%. Saturday, put Saturday, put cost about 40 about 26 degrees. West, west, about 7 to 10 to 6 to 7 to 28 miles. Ship it to southwest, but 5 to 7 miles. For Monday, for Sunday, most of the city podcast about 40 about 24 degrees. West, about 6 miles to 10 miles. For Monday, put Saturday, put cost about 3 to 6 about 19 degrees. For Tuesday, most of the city about 35 degrees. For the night, I checked the snow between 7 p.m. and 8 p.m. Mostly cost about 25 degrees. The chest reached 30 percent. One day, I checked the snow put Saturday, put cost about 40 about 25 degrees. Chest reached 30 percent. For Thursday, most of the city about 35 degrees. Here in Nottingham, 40 degrees in Taunton, 41 overcast, Nottingham at 39, and Best Fit at 39, and it's overcast, guys. And that is going to be it for the Peter Channel. Morning news at 7.58 on this January 27, 2017. Ah, oh, hey. Friday morning, PC. Good morning, good night, and good night. Good night.